Right, the performance portfolio that, um, if we just use the AUQUA performance portfolio, what did it aim to do? And really, the portfolio is a statement about us. It's how we say who we are, what we're doing, what our purpose is, and how we actually go about our business. And what is um, the body of evidence that we use to demonstrate how well we're tracking. So, in a nutshell, that's what the portfolio is about. It's uh, a fit, reasonably succinct document when you consider the size of the organisation and the nature of our business, and it's a and it's intentionally that that way. But it's supported by a large volume of information. It's not intended to be a fully comprehensive uh, audit of everything we do. What it does is it tests the evidence, so it takes snapshots and exemplars of evidence rather than the full body of evidence. It's a, an important document to articulate our claims. So we make claims about how well we're doing in things and uh, the way we go about our processes, the systems we have to support that, uh, support our business. And what the audit does is articulates those claims and links that to the evidence. Now the auditors will look at that and see how that, um, whether that seems adequate or not adequate based on comparators in some ways with the rest of the sector. So it's not different to a benchmarking exercise. The portfolio um, also enables us to outline areas that we believe we still need to improve or that we are evolving or developing and that's an important part. So it's a, not a static document. You don't have to have everything done by the time the audit comes. Organisations like ours are not static, they're dynamic, they're constantly changing and so this is reflected within the portfolio. The portfolio itself and the whole process of the, an audit like AUQUA enables us also to do a reflection on our own practices and identify areas that we're doing well, we may not be doing so well, or that we're lagging in and um, helps us to also readjust and reevaluate our own systems and processes.